live and direct. Yo, yeah. live and direct. What's going on, Yao Ming? My name is Destroy. Yeah, this is Freestyle. And we make up a crew called The Arsonists. Yes. Straight from New York. Yes. Tell us about your story. What you released, what you have shared so far. Uh huh, uh huh. Um, well, we've been uh, the arsonists since 1995, four, something like that. And we came to Europe um, years ago as a whole unit. 90, yeah. 92. Right? And we uh, rocked a lot of shows, and everybody has went and moved on to doing their own thing. Q Unique has his own album. Uh, Jice is another member who went mm -hmm. on to do his own thing. Mm -hmm. And me and Freestyle have a passion to always do live shows. Yeah. So we keep the legacy of arsonists, pure b-boys, shout out to all the DJs, yep. shout out to all the graffiti artists, yep. it means a lot to us. That's so right. we embrace and like to see that around the world. Mm -hmm. Translate for the people. It's cool. Okay, I was one. What's your opinion for the hip hop state today? Uh, the state Brand of hip hop is wonderful. The reason why I say that is because right now we are here and we are part of the state of hip hop. Uh, we are rocking right now, as you guys can see, in France. And I am sure there are so many hip hop groups out here that do their own thing. Shout out to NTM, shout out to IM. Shout out to all the people who pay dues along the way and keep the legacy and the wonderful, beautiful culture that we have of hip hop existing in 2010. That's right. Yeah. Uh, who are your influences? Uh, my influences is uh, I come from a house with an alcoholic and a police officer. Yeah. Right? So my mother sang and my father played music. So every night, little boy, I went to sleep at 6 o'clock in the morning because they would always play music. Yeah. Those are the beginning of being an influential person when it comes to music. Right. Period for me. My influences were my mom. She was always into music. She would buy vinyl. She would play vinyl since I was a baby. I would perform. I would do shows when I was a little boy, little baby, and in, in, in parties and stuff like that. And I was influenced by Rakim, Michael Jackson, Babyface Edmonds, Einstein, Bruce Willis. I'm inf I'm influenced by movies. The streets of Brooklyn, hip hop, graffiti. Uh, which is what it's hip hop is. It's everything, man. It's everything, man. Rock music. It's everything, man. I got you. Right. Human? I'm a human <laughs> and I beatbox. <laughs> it's part of the culture and I love it. Yeah. Okay. What did the hip hop culture bring to you personally? Say again? What does what the hip hop culture mean, mean to you to personally? Bring to, okay. Uh, hip hop brings me life. Hip hop brings me love. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Hip hop brings me energy. Hip hop brings me art. And it brings me uh, the want to be creative. Hip hop brings me desire, color. Oh, he's got to translate. Yeah. <laughs> Give me five words to define your style. Five words? Uh, five words? Why not four or seven or two? Five. Five. <laughs> Five words. Um, I am the Red Bull of hip hop. Six words. Yeah. <laughs> that defines me. Okay, uh, five words that defines me. 
I am everything hip hop. Seventeen yeah. words. <laughs> <laughs> What is the last hip hop album that really hit? The last hip hop album that really, really hit you. Problem. That really hit for me. Um, there's a. I, I, It's really hard to answer. There's a in New York. I do a, a radio show, and they play DJ Premier and DJ Clips play a lot of good music. And ah, oh, Slaughterhouse um, could just come up. Diamond Actually, District. Diamond District. Yeah. Q Unique just dropped a nice one. Q Unique Between uh, Heaven and Hell. That was a great album. That is a great so album. So there's a lot of the the wonderful thing is that it doesn't stop. Yeah. I could fall in love with one, and then ah, did you hear this? Ah, you know. Little brother did a good album too. It's called Last Call, I think, or Curtain yeah. Call. Yeah, their, their last album is really good. That was a good album. There's a lot of good hip hop out there. Once again, if it is easy for you to listen to, if it is easy for you to find it, it probably isn't the best hip hop. The best thing is to go and find it. Yeah. Right. Right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Do you think this this uh, project, this project, uh, got to recognition? It's really deserved. Which project? Uh, the album. Oh, the ones that. Single, no, I mean the Arsenal. No, oh, these no, albums. The ones that, that we said. mentioned. Well, the thing is, it's like uh, a good woman. You know, we say uh, you could find the easy woman. You know, uh, 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 but to find a good woman. Mm, you have to, to you have to find you have to really look you know and that's the same thing with hip hop you have to really look a good woman never gets the recognition yeah they're not on album covers and music videos all the easy women get the, all yeah. the recognition so it's like hip hop you have to look for it and if it's not as famous it's okay because it's important to you and that makes it more special I destroy.com. Just a question. In your opinion, what is the threat of DJ what is the threat what is the threat of DJ Max as a project? Uh, in your opinion, what so is the swag? What is the, the swag of DJ Mugs as a producer? In your opinion, what is the strength of DJ Mugs as a producer? DJ Mugs does not get the recognition that he deserves. You know what? DJ Mugs is a part of one of the most phenomenal groups of in all music. Time in music. Cypress Hill, so. His strength, his quality of work mm -hmm. yeah. is very good. And congratulations to Ill Bill, who said it was an honor to, to do, do an a album project with, with Muggs. So I think the strength is good. The strength is good, but he doesn't get the recognition he deserves. I, I personally believe he deserves a lot more than he gets, you know, worldwide. You know, maybe he gets a lot of love He's in successful. California. He's successful. But I think, no, I think dude deserves more. I, I, that's my personal opinion. I think he deserves more. Like everybody else. He does. He does. I try, I try. I Coming right now, Snow Goons Project Free 
freestyle destroy freestyle destroy solo uh, group project um, I have albums coming out with in Greece Spain Germany Italy destroy is doing his solo album I think he's doing a project with Mad Lib he's also doing a TV show he also does touring with Miri Ben Ari from that works with Kanye West. Uh, also, Crazy Legs. CrazyLegsWorkshop.com. It's a show I do with the, the Rock Internet TV show. Yeah. There's a lot of stuff that goes it's too on. Much. It's too much. But too to, much. To, yeah. to really stay focused, we would just encourage people to follow us as individuals. Free, uh, me on idestroy.com and freestyle on whoisfreestyle.com. Yeah. Thank you, merci beaucoup. Got it. Peace, brothers. Word.